fuck it is, man. It's big L's in this bitch, you heard me. This nigga's mad and all. Real quick, bro. Real quick, I'm gonna keep it a bean with y'all, you feel me? Probably just straight to the beans and rice, man. I'm gonna keep it a bean with y'all, bro. I want you gonna talk about this, you heard me. For real, bro, but... Yo, after seeing them text messages, seeing the videos, hearing what the public got to say, I'm not on live, bro. I am so compelled to speak on this. I was going to stay away from it because it's a battle rap channel. You feel me? And, and I got a bad experience. Bro, I got bad experiences with speaking the truth on YouTube. They take all my channels down. My videos get flagged. Anytime I say anything about white people... Women or gay people, my videos get flagged and took down, bro. Anybody that know me, y'all know about my background. Um, um, uh, being a Hebrew Israelite and being out on the streets teaching. But I had so many channels taken down from speaking the truth. It ain't even got to be vulgar, bro. It ain't even got to be vulgar. If you speak the truth, they, they try to silence you. But I'm, I'm saying that to say, that's why I was going to stay away from this, bro. Because I ain't trying to get my channel flagged. But, bro, this shit, enough is enough, bro. For real, bro, and I feel like I gotta be the one to speak. This video might not go far, but I, we're gonna take a shot at it, bro. First, let's start right here. Let's build the foundation here. Y'all try to make it seem like Kanye West is crazy, right? I, I, I get it. That's that's the perfect stigma to put on this man. To to um, what's the word I want to use to 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 remove all validity from anything he says? He could be making sense, but you'll automatically say he's crazy. That's, that's the way to dismiss any claim or anything that this man say. By saying he crazy. Oh, he's crazy. Oh, he talking about, oh, he's crazy. You know, oh, he's mad about, oh, he's crazy. Any, anything. It don't matter what it is. Every time this man speak, if they do not want to hear it, or if they do not want to validate it, they say he's crazy. And Kanye West has said and done some crazy things. But, bro, when it comes to this parenting situation... I'm sorry, bro. I'm on his side, bro. I'm on his side, bro. Real shit. I got, I'm, I'm keeping a bean with you, bro. I got so much to say, and we about to get into it. Look, 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 bro. First, first off, I want to start off by saying this. And however this shit come out, it is what it is, bro. I got a lot to say, so I don't know. It's not no uh, specific sequence we going to talk about, but I'm, no specific sequence we going to go in. But it's a lot of shit I want to talk about. Whichever one come out first, come out first, however it happened. The first thing I want to speak on is this, bro. This Pete Davidson nigga. Bro, you out of pocket, my nigga. Real shit. I'm going to keep it a bean with you. You out of pocket, bro. Mind your fucking business. Skeet, whatever the fuck they call you, you need to mind your business, bro. Mind your business. Whatever they got going on between them, that's their business. You're nothing but a measly boyfriend, bro. And I promise you, it won't be for long. She's fucking you and sucking your dick right now, but it's going to be another nigga after you. I promise you, and it's going to be another nigga after, after that nigga. Just like it was another nigga before Kanye, it was another nigga before Ray J, and she's a thot. Let's just keep it a bang. Kim Kardashian is a whore. He should have never married that fucking witch, bro. He should have never married that devil. Every man that deal with them families, bro, every nigga that deal with them, bro, they, they, they lose that fucking mind. They get in some kind of legal trouble. They have all kinds of issues, bro. Everybody that deal with them, them, them Kardashian bitches and them other females. I can't remember the name of that family, but they connected. The one who uh, Travis Scott messed with. You feel me? Like, come on, bro. So you need to mind your fucking business, bro. You don't text a man talking about I'm in bed with your wife. You're trying to antagonize him. You're trying to get a reaction out of him, bro. There's no way you can spin that. There's no way you can make it seem like you're the victim and and, and, and he's and he's the perpetrator or or, or or like come on, bro. Fuck out of here, bro. First of all, they divorced, so why would you even use the term wife? That lets me know that you're antagonizing this man. You want him to threaten you. You want him to say some outlandish shit or 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 or, 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 or some some crazy shit. Where you can screenshot it and save your messages and give it to Kim Kardashian so so that man can't get custody of his children. I know what, that's the type of shit you white people do. Y'all fucking snakes, bro. Let's keep it a bean. Y'all fucking snakes. Your whole history says it, bro. Y'all whole, y'all got an extensive history that say y'all cruel fucking people. Y'all are unsympathetic people. Y'all do heinous things to everybody. Everybody, bro. Every single race of people y'all have done fucked up shit to. That's how y'all got this country. 
Y'all stole it. You stole it, man. You want to remind us of the Holocaust and 9-11? You don't want to talk about that, though. But anyways, so mind your fucking business, man. Next. Oh, we, we, I don't even really, Kim, you shouldn't, all I'm going to say about Kim is you, she, she's, bro, she's playing on people's emotions, bro. She's playing on people's emotions. He's trying to make it seem like this man is crazy because he don't want his daughter to be exposed to the internet, bro. There's a lot of shit that comes with being exposed to the internet, especially when you're a, a young person, preferably a female, bro. They don't know how to deal with the feedback, the negative feedback. You get what I'm saying? People making fun of them and making jokes about them and like, that could fuck up. Like, you don't want to expose your daughter to that, bro. She's already a celebrity child. You don't want to expose her to nothing else, bro. She already can't live a regular life. She can't. Because she's the daughter of Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. She can't be a regular person ever in her life. So it's bad enough for that. And then you trying to expose her to TikTok. She don't know what the fuck is going on. She think it's cool because she see mommy and all the rest of the little girls dancing it. But she don't know the, 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 the real behind it, bro. And you try to demonize this man for wanting to protect his daughter, his children away from that. Then you keep trying to keep his kids away from him, bro. You keep trying to keep this man kids away from him, making up all kinds of excuses why she can't fly out for the Don the Two release party, why she can't come to Sunday service, why she can't come to the basketball game, why she can't do this, why you just trying to purposely keep your children, his children away from him, bro. You're playing on a system. The system is set up for the women, for women to be favored. That's how it's set up. It don't matter if the if the mother is a good parent or not. The court system favors them. That's how it's set up that way to be chaotic. To emasculate the man. To destroy the man. To revoke all power that the, the little bit of power that the man got left in this country. They trying to beat the man down to a, a fucking molecule. Like, stop what you're doing. Fuck is wrong with you. Let that man see his kids. It's not just, why do women think that just because you carry a fucking baby for nine months, the kid is solely yours? No, it's not. It's his children too. He got rights too. The fuck? They pick and choose when the father is the father and when he got rights or not. When, when, when a man gets you pregnant, right? Right? And... You don't want to have the baby. Oh, he's not. He has no power. You relinquish all power from him. It's my body, my choice. I can get an abortion. Right? But let's say you want to have the child. Right? And for whatever reason, a father don't want to have the child. You still got the right to put him on child support. But I thought he wasn't. I thought he had no power. But he's the father now that you want to put him on child support. It's like these fucking games y'all play. And she's playing right into it, bro. She's playing on the narrative that he's crazy, bro. Real shit, bro. Real shit, and it's not fucking cool, bro. It's not cool. Y'all, man, it's fucked up how they treat men in this country, bro. It's, it's a reason why the most high. Listen, it's, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to give you a scripture. It's a scripture in the Bible that say, a false balance is an abomination to the Lord. A false balance is an abomination to the Lord. Everything is about balance, bro. That's why you have good, you have bad, you have up, you have down. You have right, you have less, left, you have peace, you have war, okay? You got love, you got hate. You have feminine, you have masculine. You have a mother and you have a father. It's a reason why you have a mother and a father. It's a reason why both, it's God created this dynamic for a reason. When you look into like households, right? I don't give black, white, uh, 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 Arabic, East Indian, African, the mother is usually the nurturer. She's usually the one who coddles, who coddles the children and, and let them get away with shit. And, and you, you get what I'm saying? Just, just, just let them run over top of them and, and always want to save them whenever they do wrong and excuse their, 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 uh, uh wrongdoings. The father is usually the strict, the stricter one. He's usually the disciplinary. And nothing is wrong with that as long as you got that balance in the household. As long as you got that balance in the household. If you got one fucking leg, you can't walk, you can't run, you can barely do anything. Is I don't give a fuck what you do, even if you got a fake leg. The balance is still going to be off. 
You need the actual leg. So I'm saying that to say you can't replace the father, bro. That's what happens when you take the father out the household. You cripple your whole family, bro. Real shit. And then these kids, they 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 grow up dysfunctional, bro, because they only get one side. They only get the coddling side. They only get that feminine energy. That's not good for women or men. It's not good for young women or men. You probably think it was okay because, you know, the daughters, they'll, they'll be just fine with just the mother because they're women themselves. No, they need that masculine energy too. We in history proves this, bro. Look at the black community. Bunch of statistics, a bunch of delinquents, homosexuals, gangbangers, fucking dots, all this shit, uh, bro, all this shit under the, 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 the governing body of a fucking woman. These households are being governed by women and these kids are fucked up. They fucked up because they don't have that other being there. You need the man and you need the woman. Y'all keep talking about, oh, it's okay. We don't need the man. Fuck the mess because you're selfish because you women are selfish. Y'all don't give a fuck about the dynamic that God created. Y'all don't care about, uh, 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 uh. Eh, it's so much. That's gonna take us to a whole other thing, but it's not right, bro. It's not fucking right, bro. It's not right. And instead of people trying to make it seem like this man crazy, he's crazy, he's crazy. Man, y'all should be standing up and, 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 and speaking on what's right and what's wrong, bro. For real, bro. Y'all ain't never read the story of the boy cried wolf? Yeah, he might have he might have cried wolf and was bullshitting a whole lot of times, but that ninth time he did it, it was real. So, yeah, he might have did some crazy shit and said some crazy shit a whole lot of times where he wasn't justified. But this time it's real, bro. It's fucking real, man. The media is against him, bro. The music industry is against him. His friends are against him. His family is against him. His ex-wife is against him. Stop what the fuck y'all doing, bro. Now, if the shoe was on the opposite foot and it was a woman being treated like this, the whole world would have stopped, bro. I'm tired of this fucking feminist shit, bro. And y'all can say, well, for years, the man has been... That's because that's the way it's supposed to fucking be. It was ordained to be that way by the most high to create it. Y'all ain't create shit. He created all this shit. If y'all can't, let me see you recreate an animal. Let me see you create a fucking tree. Let me see you fucking create some water. You fucking can't do it because the most high did it. And that's the way it's supposed to be. It's a reason why, why men had to give women freedom and rights and, you feel me, liberty to do shit. Because that wasn't the way it was supposed to be. It's been this way for centuries, nigga. For fucking millenniums. And the world has prospered. We got up until this point. I guarantee you, if the world was the way it is now, hundreds of years, we would have never made it to this point. You don't ever give a woman the fucking power, bro. And you see why. All they do is self-destruct. Come on, man. When a man was... In his right rulership, bro, in his right state of fucking mind, he never said, we don't need the woman. We don't need our mother. My, my child don't need her mother. We can do this by ourselves. A man never did that unless, unless the, and, and you have situations like that because the bitch was fucked up in the mind. She was just detrimental to him. But when you see what happens when you give women power, they make the wrong decisions. I don't need a man. I don't need a man. We don't need fuck. We don't need... Come on, man, stop what the fuck you doing, bro. I'm tired of this shit. Big L's in this bitch. Mad enough.